There we go. Hi. Um, happy Wednesday. I figured... Listen, I talked about it last night, but I think I'm going to keep working on the DOS stuff today because I really enjoyed that. That was a lot of fun. And, um... You know, I got, like, the scene, but I need a countdown for it now because what's a DOS scene without a countdown? Without a proper boot sequence. So, um... I'm just, uh... Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to be working on today. Just a nice hanging out afternoon stream stream. And, um... That's about it. Also, Lux is down here and she's giving kisses. Because she's the best baby. Oh, that's a loaf. Oh, oh, that's a good nibble. Oh, there she goes. She did the, the chomp. She did a good job. Oh, she's the best loaf. Oh, that's the best loaf. Hello, the loaf. Probably because my fingies taste like chicken or salt. Both. He's just... Yeah. Uh, I need to change the lower third while I'm thinking about it. Lower third. There we go. That works. Okay. That's good. Hi, Sammy. I love you. Also, hi, Liz. I, uh... Lopez, you down here. She never sits on this side of me. She never does that, but she's being a kitty. Are you being a kitty? Yeah. Yeah, she's the best kitty. Oh, kitten's cat. Oh, kitten's cat. Oh, oh, I got a paw. Oh, I got that paw. That's a good paw. Thank you. I wish I wish you could. I wish you could see Loaf giving kisses. She's just giving so many kisses. She's just sitting under the desk, being a kitten's cat, and giving all of the kisses. But she's just a baby. Hey, can I have a paw? Oh. All right, good paw. Thank you. Good job. That's a good job. We gotta trim her nails. Gonna trim her nails, gonna do her flea meds. We're a little behind on that. It's okay though. She never goes outside. We keep her safe and clean. I do too. I do too, Liz. Thank you. Um, oh, I gotta start the music. Where's the music? There we go. That works. Nice. Oh yeah, this music is choice. I love this. Um, <clears throat> oh, Kalidokali. Uh, okay. So I have the DOS box. I need to make, uh, Actually, let's let's duplicate this. There we go. <clears throat> hmm. Let's add a Now we're going to move some of this stuff over. You're a nerd, Viv. Hi, Viv. Hi, Warder. What's going on? All right, let me see.
Alright, yeah, we're gonna consolidate some of this stuff. Uh, oh, I need to move this up in the hierarchy. It needs to go like... Yeah. <clears throat> ah. And this can be bossbox.css. We can pull font here, put it in here. And then I don't really need you. Vegeta, no! Vegeta, yes! Your face is error code, Venus. Yeah. Get wrecked or whatever. I don't need that anymore. All right. All right, there we go. That works. <clears throat> uh, every time, order. Every time. Every time. Okay, for this, I don't need... We're going to take out some of this stuff. I don't need any of this right now. I'll leave the hide. I guess I could put that in here. I can actually move this up because this is going to be probably, yeah. <clears throat> leave that there. Now we can take this out. Um, I take that one thing out of the DOS box, the main scene, because we don't ever use it here. <clears throat> the all of Lolly's vocabulary, for the most part, yes. For the most part. Where's the local? We went to go do important loaf stuff. All right. <clears throat> Make sure this still works right. Perfect. Exactly what I want. Okay. Um, that's good. I think the DOS box, I think this scene is good for now from a background perspective. I do need to move the... I do want to move the content just a smidge. Um, let's do, do that in... OBS real quick. Oh, no, not that one. No, I wanted it. I like that amount of, yeah, I like that. <clears throat> and then the stream source will be, see? Yeah, I think that's fine. It is a little weirdly distracting to have that cursor blinking in the background, isn't it? I might have to turn that back. And I'm gonna... Viv, I swear to God. You know what, Viv? You know what? Bully did. Yeah, how do you like that? How do you like me now? Duck ass motherfucker. <clears throat> I'm gonna put this as hide for now. So let's just refresh that. Okay, that's good. 
Yeah, I like having the little bit of separation there. That's good, I think. I think that's good. Actually, that works out because, like, kind of puts a little evenness on this side and on this side of the content where the voice stuff is. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Um... Good. Mm, this is good vibes. I like the vibes of this. This is really good. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna I'm gonna leave it in, but I'm gonna hide it for now. Okay, that's all happy and and stuff. Um, for the countdown. I don't need any of this. Um, don't need the news bar stuff. I don't need. I got you, babe. I mean, that's mean. Babe. Okay. We know that for the DOS box, the max number of lines that we're going to have. That's a bean. <clears throat> I might do a set of alerts for this. I might do a set of alerts for this scene. Probably will end up doing a set of alerts for this scene. <clears throat> um... All right, so let's, how's that work? Oh, that's the GitHub link. I don't want the GitHub link. I want, yeah, that makes sense. Copy path. I like this. And through Firebot is a standalone browser source, a standalone source order. So, um, the most of my, um, like the design, the fully designed overlays are in OBS. Um, so like this one, that's the current scene is a standalone browser source. <clears throat> but what I have is, or things like the news bar down here. This this news bar is powered by Firebot. Um, so I have code in it um, where I get custom variables values from Firebot. Uh, and that's what I um, that's what I bring back is uh, those custom variable values. You should Viv. What do you should? I think you'd be really good at it. I think you'd be great at it, in fact. Okay. Uh, I'm going to keep this up as a reference because I, I do. I will need the codes at some point, but I'm not worried about that right now. <clears throat> so, yeah, it, it does do, like, it does interface with Firebot. And, um, Firebot, like is the automation platform behind all of it, but the actual browser sources are just browser sources uh, in OBS. I know you could, Warder. You just gotta do it, buddy. You just gotta sit down, and it, and sometimes it takes time to do that, but you'll get it. And... Okay, our boot sequence, so. <clears throat> oh. 
what we have right now. Okay, so here's here's something that I want to uh let's see here. So I kind of want the boot screen, like the, the actual loading screen, to look something similar to this. This is DOS 6.22 setup, and I like this look of like a title, some stuff in the middle, the footer like we have here, and then a progress bar down at the bottom in this area to show like how far along we are in the countdown process. That's order, that's understandable, buddy. I, that I definitely understand. I will order. <clears throat> it's just like a matter of um, starting like with I, I want to start with this because this will be the countdown. Um, but I want to have a boot sequence that leads into this. If that makes sense. So I want this to be uh, this will be I'll set up and we're going to go, uh, I'll set up is going to be position of fixed top zero, left zero, bottom zero, right zero. Background color blue um color the white um and then this is going to be hide for now so this should give us just a blue screen which is what we want yeah, you know, the old days of DOS games and shit. Yeah, Warder, like, I've I've been wanting to do something like this for a while, and I just hadn't done it yet. And I was like, you know, I, like, it's one of those things, like, you get the, like, something hits you, you know? You get that spark of inspiration, and you're like, okay, I gotta sit down and do this, because this is gonna be cool when I'm done. Like, I, like the, the overlay that we have here, like, this is, this is so fucking cool to me. Like, I love this. I love this shit around me. This is so cool. Um, now I just want to do more of it. And have it like even more fleshed out, because like again, what's a proper what's a DOS screen without a proper boot sequence? Um, so now let's come here and go div id equals title. Uh, let's go. Let's name these proper. Um, I'll set up title. And we will go position fixed top. We want this to be or how many lines down do we have this? Looks like we have looks like we might just have one line of one line here, so like at one one, so we'll do top forty pixels. Left twenty pixels, <clears throat> and then we'll go like this. We'll go how does that do it? That does those, so I want the there it is twenty five fifty okay. So I want in number X twenty five fifty. Okay. T O M E T O T H E. Okay. Oop! I didn't put a. I gotta put a break in there. There we go. Next music. There we go. Like that. <clears throat> I 
Look at that, I nailed it. <clears throat> That looks pretty close. Yeah, I like that. I might bump it in just a smidge, just because, like, I have... It's widescreen, so I have so much more real estate, and... I think that's better. I think that's better. Break time. Nice. Honestly, I'm surprised that I got, like, the number of things here first time. Um, okay. Now I want to go... <clears throat> uh, let's see. I want... Let current... Um... God, I typed currency by default because I just refactored all the... Uh, the currency manager stuff in Firebot. Uh, current. Function. Notate. Marquee. Alright. Then what I want to do is I want to go. Um, const mark the items equals, and we'll make this an array. Nope. Oh, come on. Nope. There we go. Okay. And you, I'm going to move down. So, let's see. What's my list of stuff that I have now? This is what I have now. I just put these in here. Why I did that in that's why I did that in single quotes. Actually, I could just do this in back ticks. Like Yeah, we're just going to do this in back ticks. Oh, I have to fix that one. That's why. Yeah. There we go. Because I'm never going to use back. Look at me doing stuff. Two, three character widths. Yeah, I think I think I think it looks better a little further over. Because I'm going to have more stuff in here. I just got to figure out where. Um. Okay. Now let's go. DOS set up. Footer. Um. We're going to make this. How do we have this over here? The app footer is. Oh, I have that calculating from the top down, which is fine because it calculates out evenly. Background color var white. Color bar black. And then I could put, I'll probably put the marquee text in here. I'll set up footer span ID equals text. I don't know. There we go. Maybe I'll do like, do like this and like,
And let's put some non-breaking spaces in there. And now we should have a bar at the bottom. Let's add a little bit of padding in here. We'll go zero and 20 pixels so that we have a space on either side of it. This is looking pretty nice. Uh, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, I'm happy with that. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, yeah, this is good. Where's my number, Majig? I guess technically it is. That's. That's that would have bothered me because we it's a height of 1080, 40 pixel height, that's 27 lines technically. All right, that makes sense. Um I want to do it. Yeah, order. This is good. This is this is more game shop stuff. It's just nice and chill and like it's very good for this kind of stuff, I think. Okay. Let's do um current marquee item plus plus if current marquee item is greater than or equal to times that length. Current marquee item equals zero. Um, set to timeout. Go. Actually, I guess it's just rotate marquee, and we could do the timeout is item equals zero. 30, um, 15, so we go like this. So what will happen here, this is, this is kind of the same logic that I have in the countdown now. Um, yeah, I mean, this starts the message loop, but it's, Yeah. So here's what here's how it works. Um we go in, we rotate, and we say, Alright, we start an item zero, which is the first item in the list, because computers like to count starting from zero. Um so we start on the first message. Then when we rotate, we run the next one. Okay. Then when we run the next one. Um, we are going to put it up and then once it's, once we put it up, we tell it to rotate again. Now, if the current item, if the new current item is the first message in the list, we want that to sit for 30 seconds. Otherwise we do it for only 15. Yeah. Oh, I have a great idea for how I want to do this. 
Yeah, this is how I want to do this. That item, wait, element, text, text, and marquee items, current marquee item. Yep. Uh, now I want to do this as. I wonder how I want to do link text, because this is already going to be a blue background. So I don't want to do like another blue. I don't know that I want to do like blue. I, I mean, I can't do blue on blue, then you can't see it. Let's come down here and do how we want to do link text. So let's go, let's change the background color on it to Yeah. And then we want the marquee. To absolutely, Viv. Go for it, buddy. To left forty pixels. Up. We got ads coming in about three minutes. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Let's do 14 lines and see how that goes. You mount slash mount slash, yeah. That's, that's the wrong fucking window, buddy. <laughs> Wrong window, but still good context. Oh, okay, so that's a great question, Viv. CSS allows you to define variables that have predetermined values so that if you have something like certain branding that you wanna do, branding colors, or if you're doing like specific um, values for widths and things like that, you can set up those variables. No, buddy, Warder, you're fine, buddy. You're absolutely fine. Um, you can define those variables so that if you want to change something, and this works especially well with color values, you can change it once in the variable definition, and then everywhere that refers to that variable, you can use it again. So in this case, I have specific colors of like white, black, and blue that all correspond to these colors that I have set at the root, um, the root level of the CSS definition, okay? Louie. Love you, buddy. So in this case, Viv, I have these colors here, and these are the actual colors that are the like original console colors for um, for IBM PCs. So I want to make sure that I'm always using the correct colors instead of having to like stick these values always back in. I just know I want the white one. I put the white one, which the white is like the 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 light gray. Um, if I want the blue, I want the blue. If I want to do like green, there's the green and all this stuff. So I get to use all of these colors by name instead of having to do them by their individual color value every time. So if I come in here and I change something and I refresh it, then everywhere that refers to that blue automatically uses the new value and I only have to change it once versus having to change it in like 20 different places. But yeah, I've got this separate um, style sheet that I've got defining a bunch of stuff since I'm gonna have multiple of these documents Hi, it's having me, all Stan. the same styles. Ask for them by name. Yeah, exactly, exactly, Viv. Like it's a lot easier to remember blue versus, you know, whatever. So, yeah. There's a kitten. She came back. Love. Ah, oh, baby. Gonna get in the chair.
Here with Strawby. Oh, you want a pet? Oh, she said snuggle in. That's nice, sir. Oh, hello. There's so many snuggles. If earlier she gave me the paw. You said? Is that a paw? Oh. I want to love, don't you? Oh, she's like, come here, I just want to love you. Best at it. Just keep me. Yeah, that's my girl. Love you. Ah. Uh, now, in, in the case of the old countdown, or the, like, the, the regular countdown, I have, like, a whole thing where, like, the messages roll in and out, so, like, it does, like, a, a rolling thing. I don't need to do that here because this is this is DOS, so it just like is an instantaneous thing. So I don't need to have all of that logic here. So yeah. And then for you gotta Listen. Don't worry about it, okay? Don't even worry. It's fine. It's don't worry about it. It's fine. You've been busy working on variables. You've been refactoring like literally every variable ever. I don't want to hear it. going pretty good um i'm getting to like the this little guy right here which is fun i guess i could set this with like the initial text Ooh, no wait i don't even need to do that i could just do that yeah there we go there we go yeah we'll just Boop. Tip of the day. I guess I could probably put that on the same line. I probably don't need to have a separate line for it. Let's just bump that up. There we go. Second round of ours only had, like, nice. That's good. You've been chewing through them the last couple of days, bud. All right, so that's going to do its thing. We're going to give it like a second. I just want to see it start rotating one. Which we have to. Oh, no, I can't do that. I have to. No. I can do this, though. I have an idea. I have an idea. Uh, let's do some padding on that. Just the tip of the day. That's right. Doing work. Oh yeah, no, he's he's uh, he's here. He's like fucking Roz from Monsters Inc. He's always watching. Also, I have cookies. Ignore my crinklies. I don't care. I have chocolate chip cookies. Mm. So soft, such cookies. Gib. Uh, yes, Viv. There is a link pinned in, um, there's a link pinned in, um, in the general channel and Discord also. 
think cookies is cookies not enabled. Oh, okay. Cookies is enabled. There we go. Cookies is enabled. Uh, we have enabled cookies. The best kind of cookies that we should enable. All right, um, accept them or be cursed. That's also true. I like this. Like, I really like the highlight of the, uh, the link text. Like, I like that styling. That's I think that's fun. I don't know what y'all think, but I really like it. Like, that's that's pretty good. Needs more yeller. Needs some comfy vibes today. <gasps> Kay, hi, buddy. Good to see you. I'm good. How are you? Scan disk yeller? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be adding that there yeller. Alright, let's uh let's start doing this. So we want DOS set up progress bar. And I want this to be background color yellow. It's Tom, it's it's more of the it's more of the imperative than the instruct like the the knowledge of what it does. It's like just do it. Go do it. Listen here, reject. Fuck you, buddy. This is stuff specific to this one document that's not shared. Shared CSS is over here. Shut your face. Shared scripting functionalities over here. Shut your face. You you nerd. If, if cookies output gib, correct. Any last one? Oh no, okay, I'm sorry, buddy. That's oh, that's no fun. Oh, reject notes, he's just pushing my buttons. He knows what he's doing. Uh alright. Yes. We're going to start and we're going to put this. Wait, no, I want. I want this down here. From silent, from logic? No, absolutely not. I'm gonna inline everything. Okay. We'll have a cocoa. Hmm, cocoa. Hi, car says, how are you, bud? You're doing all right. Um, let's go. Still working on my stuff. Um, I'm working on, so this is actually for the stream overlay right now. Um, so I built this overlay the last couple of days and I'm working on a boot sequence style thing to kind of go along with it. I want to put something in here just to have it and position fixed. 
The marquee is at 14. So I want this to be like at... It's going, it's going. Um, I'm just, you know, hanging out and uh, working on stuff while I got some good inspiration and some juices flowing, stuff like that. Let's see. I'm gonna do this at how many columns in do I want this? Let's do this at eight, because I have like ninety-six that I can work with and see how this works. Which means I'm gonna move this in and I'm actually gonna put this line break back in here. Come here. South, it's huh, Var Yeller. It's Yeller. I like, I like that better, yeah. Okay. Um, so that's at 18, that's at 14. I'm happy with that. So now we can go and set up the I want the progress bar. There we go. The other got deaded. <laughs> One of my, they're like two things from that movie are two of my favorite things ever. And it's the one like where they're, when the, the barn and the barn's burning down. It's like, damn, we're in a tight spot. And um, when they're in the theater and they get like reunited, we thought you was a toad. So fucking good. That movie is hysterical. Love that movie so much. Of course you are, Warrior. Of course you are. Ah, and calm thine tits. Actually, no, here's what we're going to do. <clears throat> because... Because this is a, because it's all blocked and shit, we can do this. Now I need the character codes. And suck my whole <laughs> Child labor, god damn it. <laughs> oh, all right, now I need Two fifty C twenty five hundred. Nope, not that one. Um And now I need 
Let's put that in here and let's see how that goes. I'm going to have to count, but it's not that big of a deal. That's actually getting there. It went perfect. Yeah, it's nailed it. First try. Okay, now I need the sidebar. Where the heck is it? Oh, it's way down here. 2502. Did I? Oh, no. 2502. There we go. Order, order, buddy. You gotta, you gotta not do that. Like, anytime that you think about doing that, you just don't. I think really is the, the key lesson here. I guess I could. I could programmatically fill this in. Eventually it's going to be a password. Oh, no, that's, that's bad. That's bad, Juju. You don't want to do that. This is why password managers are handy. It's true. It's true. Okay, here's I I actually am going to end up making this a div. Then what I'll do is I will go I don't need Yeah. Uh. Okay. You're going to get banned today? No, you're fine. Oh. Usually it's only Krakow that gets banned. Now I need to do... There we go. Don't say it like it's a goal, that's... Thanks, Karsis. I know. Listen, reject. Go do your goddamn variables. Telling me like I don't know. Been fucking up the progress. Work. Listen here, motherfucker. <laughs> Uh, progress bar indicator. Oh, left. 
There. That's better. We ain't progressing on the progress bar. <laughs> we just... <laughs> Thanks, Tom. Two out of three chuckle fucks agree. Penis. Ooh, broccoli cheddar soup. That's one of Bean's favorites. Nice crusty baguette. Mm hmm. We. Oui. Leftover pizzas. I had Zaxby's. I had, uh, I had boneless wings and things. A club sandwich. Oh, I love a good club sandwich. Not even a member. Thank you. Beautiful. Okay. Um, let's do. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of. Get rid of this, and then we'll do a bottom below here. Yep. Listen, I'm just saying, it's really fucking good sauce, okay? It's really good. Zaxby's, if you have a Zaxby's local to you, go and get wings. Doesn't matter whether traditional or boneless, either way. Or you can get the tenders tossed in sauce as well. Whatever. The point is, they have this garlic buffalo sauce that they started carrying a little while back, and it is incredible. And... Hold on, I just heard Loaf, like, drop something. I just want to make sure she's okay. Okay, um, <clears throat> so we have, by our front door, we have like a full height, um, like about this wide window, like frosted glass window, and uh, we have a, a sheer curtain there, just, you know, something nice to have there, that's uh, held up by tension rod, and every once in a while the tension rod will like lose tension and then it falls and she likes to lay there because sun comes through there and you know so uh it just it dropped whisper 
Then's in a frame border. Yeah, it, yeah, it, 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 yeah, it's fine. Where's the... About that Zaxby sauce, yeah. Garlic buffalo sauce. It's, oh, so good. Listen, a cheddar soup is still delicious, Liz. I'm not even a fan of broccoli, so... Here, maybe I can fix that. Make it reject. No, it should be. All right, I'm gonna. I can't even tell. It's fine. I'll I'll listen. Work on it later. Um, I still want this to be further in, so we're going to do 12. What the hell? Oh, because I changed it. Okay, that's good. Split pea and ham soup. I can't do peas. I can't just peas. I don't. I don't jive with peas. I don't jive with broccoli. That's, Tom, you're thinking of something else. All right, let's go back to this, and I want 2514 and 2518. Boy, that is way the hell out here. That's a that's a lot. I'm I'm very tempted to. I might make it too. I like that better. This is uh this is Windfall Island from it's a piano rendition, obviously, but it's from uh, uh the Legend of Zelda the Wind Waker. Okay, beef and broccoli stir fry, that I can do. That I'm fine with.
Oh, it's because I picked the wrong one. Yeah, I like the I like the double height. Five six B. Oh, I think as I have I was gonna do it a different way before. This is the uh, Gerudo Valley theme, Liz. Did I still not pick the right one? Oh, that's a cross through. Damn. 25622. Two. There you go, reject. Why am I not just using JavaScript? I don't know. I don't know. For some places I do, like uh, on this, on the overlay here, for the frame left, right, and bottom, I actually do fill it in with JavaScript. So, like the side contents, I go and I basically make an array, fill it with the number, and then join them with line breaks. Hmm. <clears throat> It, that's also true order, but I, I work a lot in it, so I have to, you know. So for, like, the, the, the main, like, title frame of this, it is filled in with JavaScript, like, title bar and all, because the title up at the very top up there is dynamic. So what I do is I can come to my... Where's my, uh, my admin tool? I can come in here... And I can say, change this, and then it changes up there and automatically puts in, like, the stuff that's around it. Could I potentially, like, do it differently and just have, like, have that Z order on top of it? I could. Do I like it better the way it is? Because I have to make things difficult. Also, yes. Instead of guessing links in the progress bar. Not repeat. That's... Uh, I might end up doing that. I don't know yet. I, I just... I haven't decided yet. Like right now, right now, this is just a placeholder. The indicator here is just a placeholder just so I see what it looks like. Like I'm just doing the design phase of it first and then I will actually, I'll go through and redo and like do the logic. Like I will probably, I will probably go in and clean this up. Like I have here. Cause that's what I do here. Like, for the most part, except for that one line, just the voice thing. Um, I will probably go through and clean up and do it like this. But right now, I'm just getting into a place where I like it, where I want to see it. And then we'll go from there. Yeah, it's just, like, I, I like to do, especially for stuff like this, I like to lay it out first and then get a good visual on it. Then go through and kind of break chunks up and see where I can make it more, 
I don't know, easier to manage. That's why I have like here, that's why I know how many like lines and columns that I have because I plan on doing that exact thing. Even though I'm not using them in this file right now, I do use them over here. Like when I set the title, I do the same thing. That's what I do is I'm using repeats based on the title length. Can be packaged and distributed as a file? Uh, yes, actually Liz, uh, I put this up on GitHub yesterday. Um, let me grab a link for it. So I, I put it up on GitHub. If you want to go like screw around and look at the source, you can. Hi, Faf. Love you, buddy. Um, a donation button on my GitHub. I do. I do. I don't have it on this particular thing, but um, like if you go to my profile, um, I do have a, well, let's see. How can I? I'll show you like the yeah there's a sponsor button on the GitHub. So hmm. yeah, Faf, this is uh this is the stuff that I'm working on, man. I'm just I wanted to do the like the um the DOS style stuff and been thinking about doing it for a while and I'm just like, you know what, I'm gonna do it. Like what the hell, why not? So, okay, let's come back to the countdown. Like here, all right, I'll just go ahead, and, just to make reject happy. That's what I'm here for. Turn star state into SVG. I know that was going to be really cool when once you do that. All right, let's go here and go. Um, set element contents. I want the doll setup title. I can go. Oh, uh, let's see here. Title. Break and then take this and go eat title dot link. And now I can take this stuff out. And now, did I break it? Oh. There we go. Yeah, it's like, I'm really excited for you to get that done, Reject. That's going to be really nice. God, I keep doing that. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. 
There you go, Reject. See? I'm taking stuff out of markup and putting it in script. You nerd. That title set up. No people making streams. Yeah, time for techie themes. I mean, I'm I'm considering doing this kind of stuff for people that want me to actually just do it and set it up for them. I'm I'm I could do that, and you know. But I mean, I made the code, and someone wants to do it and take the stuff that I've made and adapt it. You know, go for it. Okay, so element, contents. Go like this. I was there just to make sure you wouldn't kill people's GPU with too many stars. I noticed mine was like, mine was consistently at like 90 on my phone, so that was pretty good. Theme, top it's valuable. Yeah, that's, that's, and that's like, that's kind of what I do with this theme here is, again, like the, the title, the title up there is, um, is fed from, like the bot powers that. And then the, like the marquee down in the bottom corner down there, that's also powered by the bot, like the latest subscriber and all that stuff. Like that's, that's bot powered. Hello, baby. Oh, hello. Both came back to see me because she's the best kitten. Loves to get. Come say hi. No. There's just a snuggler. That's my little cat. Love you. Best kitten. Ah. Uh. I want this to be max line length. Um, wait, I have it. This is what's the same thing with the bottom. What the hell is it? Oh, there it is. There we go. Certain amount of graphic cards education, you make your own lazy however and choose not to, and it bites you in the ass a lot. That's fair. That's fair. I don't have as much, like, I don't have, I have graphic design skill. 
Um, and I have like UI and print design stuff. Like UI print design is my thing. Um, but as far as like artistic style stuff, like I'm not, that's not my thing, which is why I pay other people to make my emotes and shit. Um, so yeah. I'm going to consolidate this down because this is going to be a thing that gets called later. There we go. Okay. And you don't have a start countdown yet, but you're about to... Where's my... Lunch is eight, it's nap time. Nice, go have a nap, buddy. Move this down. Yeah, we'll move that down here. There we go. That's fine. Again, then timer equals zero. Oh wait, no, I want that. Perfect. Did I... You go take your nap, old man. Get out of here. I love you, buddy. You need to do an art thing for the first. Well, I don't sketch of an emote for the wall or something. Ooh. Of course, um, Fafco. Th oh, you got a, oh, you got an imager link. Well, that's cute. I love it. Very tusky. Love a good tusk. No, you'll nap, but I. Oh, okay, Grandpa. Let's get you back to bed. Okay. Great emote, but you had fun. There you go. That's that's all right. That's all right. Listen, you had fun. That's what matters. Duppy, welcome in. Hope you're enjoying your nap. All right, let's see. Um, Dejected look you were going for? I, I, I'd I, say so, Faf. Absolutely. Let's pull this down. I don't need that anymore for now. Okay. Oh, yeah. Pull this in. Okay. 
Okay. Current time. Play the interval. Okay. This, I'm not going to do any of this because I don't care about any of that. That's all the animation and like showing the numbers for the regular countdown screen. Um, yeah. Thanks. Has brought you here. The naps are going to make you say nice. Nice. Well, welcome in. I'm glad to have you. I don't care about any of that stuff. Um, actually, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start this at zero and I'm going to increment it. Come on. Thank you, Liz. I love you. You know I love you. Uh, total time. Clear the interval. All right, that's fine. Now, here's what I need to do. What I need to do is... I need to do... Um... Do... Last top floor. Current time over total time. And then multiply that times 100. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm going to do that here. Yeah. Uh, okay, so then we'll have percent complete. We'll know what that is. That's, Liz, that's all I try to do is provide a place for folks to where they can, they can hang out and, and get away from some of the shit. That's all I want is for people to just have a nice place where they feel okay. And that doesn't mean everything's going to be good all the time, but... It'll it'll be all right, I think. Now, boy, that's a really no. Okay, that's better. It's better. Okay. That element text. Head to the basement and the space heater. Ooh, space heater. Space. I think I like installed. Yep. Okay. And we also will need to for the indicator. Then we'll do uh, the non-breaking space, and we'll repeat this. All right, that's good. Then we'll call this mm -hmm. now. Here's where things get funky. So the we set up the bar. We do max line length here, okay. Hmm.
Yeah, this is fine. Math dot floor, and we're gonna put I feel weird dividing that again. But I think what I'm going to do is we're just going to do this. And then we'll do No, I can't math dot floor that. Um I want to math dot trunk. Can I do no? I I guess I can round. Shit. No. Okay. I'm gonna have to leave that 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 way. Yeah. Yep. Because I want that to. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. So here's. Here's what's gonna happen. This will calculate our percent like 10% or whatever. Then we get our progress bar length by taking the percent complete as an actual fraction or a decimal. Multiply that by what our max line length should be inside of the progress bar. And then we just fill it with spaces. That's, I think that's gonna work. I think. Less than one. We gotta divide by zero. Total time total time's a const, so it'll always So yeah. Also hi Tani. Um so yeah, total time's a const. So we track current time. And then current time is always going to be at least one. All right, I have some error here. Let's. What have I done? First, I got to do that. Element text. That's hmm. Tony, how you doing, buddy? Current countdowns here. Update counters here. We have set element text. The marquee is fine. Stayed up until 3 a.m. doing work. Oh, oof. That's a long time. Here. Well, let's just pop open the console, see what it says. Did I not update that? I thought I updated that. Oh, that's... Okay, that's where it was. Got it. Not quite enough sleep, but enough to be awake. Yeah, I, I feel that. All right. Oh, the percent indicator. I don't have a... Uh... Um... Position fixed. That's going to be 17 and 12. Uh, I think I want that at 18. Oh, right. I have to do contents because it's... I can't just do text there. Yeah. 
Right, because it, it does it as a literal. What the hell did I do there? Oh, do that. I have milk for coffee, but you don't feel comfortable driving. Yeah, that's oof. <gasps> oh, you got new nails? Why didn't I? I didn't see new nails. Oh, did you, Tony? Did you post them on uh, Mastodon? Is that why I haven't seen them? Because I haven't been there in a few days. Just only just cross space. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you uh, if you want to, wherever you feel comfortable. All right. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Let's let's drop it to 30 just to watch it like uh What I'm going to do. Yeah. Selfies and stuff? Oh, I love selfies and stuff. It's where I get all of my selfies and most of my stuff. Ooh, those look oh, good. Those look really good. I like those. All right, now let's bump this up to 30 seconds just so we can watch it complete a little faster. This hab returned. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take this down to 250 milliseconds, because who's going to stop me? Oh, I guess that doesn't... Alright, let's do that then. They also match your jacket. Oh, your new one? This is pretty good. I hate that, like, after a while it throttles the fucking JavaScript on a page. Like, I wish I could turn that off. I wish I could turn the throttling off. Um, do we have another one here that shows it like without the disc? Like they all have the fucking thing to insert the next disc. I don't want that. Oh, wait, wait. Is this one? Is this one? Oh, be oh, the double, the window setup double frame. Oh, I should stop at 98%, right? Oh, the double frame. Shit. Hi, Gannett. Mwah. Fuck, I'm going to do the double frame, aren't I? 
Okay, like, let me ask you, what do you think? Like, do you like... Oh, that's so good. We do have... So we do have the double underline. That is something that we do already have, Tani. Um, which is consistent with the... Uh, the DOS 622 installer. So that one, that one came over, but shit. Oh, I like that. We don't have the spacing right on that one because we matched it up with this one. So it's con it's consistent with the DOS setup one. But I could update it to be... I could update it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's ever so slightly different because, like, the DOS 622 installer is... I mean, it's slightly older. But like the wind, mm. we're going to try something. Okay. If I bump it back and see what happens. I should add browser shortcuts. I was I was thinking about that. Um I don't know if I'm feeling it. I think I like this styling better for the title. I think I like this styling better for the title, but I want the Windows installer double frame. God damn it, Vivian. Stop that. Understandable, have a... Have a have a quacktastic day. On the bottom right are file names. Yeah, I'm trying trying to think of like what I could put down there for file names. I might go and see if I can get like a I might build an array, honestly, of like file names from like the original Windows installer. And just have it like randomly change those. Get ChatGPT to do God. Um, all right, let's do this. I want to move the marquee. I want to move up a couple of lines. Oh, my. Hi, Hidden. I know, right? Imagine. Imagine. Let's go put this back in place. So that's... Right. I I really like the way I did the links here. Like I really like that. What are the file names with the chuckle fuck scenes and sound effects and stream rewards? Maybe Liz. I don't I don't know if I want to go that meta with it, is the thing. So No, Viv, you stop that. A keystroke to bump to 100% and change scenes is a good idea. I, I don't know how I want to do it yet, because that's the thing, like, this is going to be an OBS, and sending input to the browser in OBS is a pain in the ass. I don't know if I want to do it that way. I might have it set up to where I can, like... Yeah, 
like sending input to the browser in OBS, like to a browser source in OBS is a lot of times more trouble than it's worth. Set up a chat command. Yeah, either that or have like a button on the stream deck or something or like a button in my admin panel. Um, I mean, what I do now is when I change scenes, I just push a button, so. This is working, like this, this part is working though. So, um, that's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Now the next part is updating it to do the... Now we're going to do an outer frame. Oh, how far in do I want to take it? All right, we're going to go... We're going to reduce this back down to one... We don't need, we don't need that to be the full height anymore. Uh, I want, I think I want to move the whole thing down. So that should, what did I do? Oh, I didn't name, update them down here. Nope. Did I not update that too? I did not. Okay. So that's moved down. Um, you I will fix in a minute. Um, now I want to do... I'm gonna make this longer now, so let's go. Oh. How much my margin? Right now I'm doing it 12. I think I might do it 20 now. Now I need to update these to be 20. It'll be 21, 20, 20, 20, 20, 21. Hmm. 
That's off by two. There we go. That's better. All right. How far? That's still a decent margin. So now let's start building out the outer frame. This is going to be our outer frame. Frame. Okay. This one's actually going to be back to our like original. That's not bad. Okay. Um. Let's see, got an ad coming up in about three minutes. Sometimes I remember to let people know. Sometimes I remember to see it or to look for it. Twenty-five fifty-one. One. Ooh. Yeah, Tony, I'm excited to hear that. 15, let's go. Go 15 and see what happens. 16, 16 23. Hmm. That's really close. No, Outer, outer, we'll go, this is actually 12, I think, um, I want, that's right, 2554. Four twenty five fifty twenty five fifty seven five A and then five D <clears throat> so close. All twelves. Oh, because I have to do thirteen. A 
And then we need to bring that up by one. I think we could bring it up by one more, it looks like. Bring that up to 22. Go we'll take. <clears throat> That's pretty good. Looking pretty good. Get rid of these placeholder spaces since I don't need them now. Now, here's what I need. The percent indicator needs to come over by and 96 divided by 2 is 48, 47, 46. I'm going to call that 45. No, I'll do 46 because that should center it. Because then we'll have... I think so. I wonder how it does handle zeros. I guess we could pad it. We could do that. We do forty six. Yeah, forty six. Yeah, and then we can do There we go, there we go. <clears throat> That's pretty centered. I want to see what it looks like when it gets to 50. Because like this is this is block and I don't I don't want to like I can center center it. But I don't want to. I feel like that's not authentic enough. And I know that sounds ridiculous. But the 50 ended up right there. Which I'm really happy about. And then. When this finishes and we get to 100. The 1 should be right under my cursor here. I'm happy with that. Um, yeah, I'm good with that. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, 
So that looks good. Now. All right, it's going to be on line 17, and this will be over by 14, I want to say. Yeah, okay, and then we'll put here for status text. I think that's fine. Everyone, please control yourselves. This is a mature party. And no! Ever. Hi, ever. Ah! Viv was very, he was very concerned. He's incredibly concerned. Ever, what are you doing? How was, how was Sandrock? Did you, did you win at Sandrock? Stortled. <laughs> Oh, uh, hi, Ever. Hi, Mags. Welcome in, everybody, from the Ever Raid. Um, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Zunderscore. I'm a variety streamer. Uh, I do all kinds of games and sometimes design and code stuff, and I'm doing Cody designing stuff right now, uh, including making my new loading screen for my new overlay stuff. So, <gasps> Caliph. Bang broke your heart again and decided to love you. So all in all, I'm calling pretty good. Yeah, that's, I'd say you won. Yeah, you won, Sandrock. Well done. Well done. <gasps> Wisty, I know Wisty. I know her. We know, we, we love Wisty. We love Ever, too. Uh, okay, so that's done. Let's go here and then we'll do on the complete stuff. Set element text. We're gonna, gonna call this. I love you ever, so there you go. Wisty is wonderful. It's true. Um, I want to make sure I'm not missing any semicolons. Because even though JavaScript won't necessarily yell about it, and I don't like not doing it. There we go. Okay. Ah. Uh, Wisty is best direction ever. It's true. It's true. I checked. All right. Let's um let's see how this goes. Come on. Come on. Loading, we're loading, we're loading. Yeah, the internet, you believed it? Yeah, I can't put anything in the internet that isn't true. That's, those are, those and other true facts found here on the internet. All right, now, Reject had put together some code for me the other day. The other day, I guess it was yesterday. I don't know. Um, he's like, here, go do your spinner like this. And I'm like, all right.
the other day. Snopes is fake news. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna totally steal this code that Reject did because he wanted to do it, and then we're gonna put it over here. Need to find a house coat and it's getting cold? Oh yeah, I bet it is. Up in the old Great White North. Hmm, let's see. I'm gonna bump this up to sixty percent. Then we're gonna go Um, status text spinner. That works. Yeah, that works. Okay. And we're going to take this thing. And we're going to go over here. And put on her sweatshirt. It was so cold up here. Good Lord. Tweet belly. Tweet belly. We love us a pupper dog. How this is going to look. I don't want that to run. Um, run, have that run every like 250 mils. Also, what's happening here? Hmm. That's the status tech spinner. That's the status tech spinner. But, uh, but like, why? Let's just do this and see what happens. It's not running. Why isn't it running? But like, why and like, don't? I don't understand.
I haven't showed off setup. Then I set the interval every quarter of a second. Like this or not. But she called. She was like, Burr, mom, what the fuck? That's. Hidden, has she been outside like during snowfall and like, <laughs> like chomped at the snowflakes? Oh, it doesn't like that. No, that should work though, right? Yeah, dot has is not a function. in oh There we go. There's our spinner. Yeah, but she has, but hasn't chomped. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. All right, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that. I love a good spinny. Hi, gadget. You liking it? Let's see, I want... Let's do, let's bump it to 70%. Where's my... I want it to spin relatively fast. Or I can bump it to 80. You know what I could do? I could put this in... Put this in OBS. And then we can do Oh wait, 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 I gotta edit the transform on this. The music is boppy, yeah, I like the we got some good music from the, uh, this is Zelda and Chill 3 from, uh, from Game Chops. It's very good. Wow. Wow. Such hostility in my chat. What the fuck?
What the fuck? So hostile. So perverse. Bean, I will give snuggles, but I make no promises about hands. Oh, shit. I messed that up. Because it copied the... Add browser. There we go. That's better. That's better. Nice ever. Also hyperny. Okay, that's... That at least gives us something to, like, look at. See how it works in real time. All right. <clears throat> Hmm. That's all good. Then you get mad after this, don't you? You do. Which is fine. Um, we can fix that. That's not a big deal. Where's the rejects code again? And I guess I could do that. And... Eh, fine. We'll get there. Make this quote 69. Stop that. We're not, I don't think we're up that far yet. No. We still have several more to go. Uh, I'm going to change that to... Starting soon. I like starting soon better, and that's going to take away a little bit of the length here. That I think I want. Hmm. Uh, what if I make that a little wider? Uh, I don't know. Progress bar indicator of 22. Progress a counter. Progress bar margin. 22. These pressures make a list of scholarships. Just want to find these scholarships. Mean, yeah.
Just recommend these websites we're using to search. Yeah, like just like just give them the don't don't do the work for them. That's the point of them going to school is to learn how to do the work. Give them the list of resources so that they can do the work. Don't do the work for them. Oh, shit. That run out fast. Will I do your home? Absolutely not ever. Absolutely the hell not. Now go to your room. Oh, okay. Well, now Viv might have a good point, actually. I think I'm going to do this. I think I'm going to widen the bottom frame. Or the outer frame, rather. Now I can do the status text into 12 now. Man, this is, I, I really like the way this looks. I always have good points. No, you don't. You have a bill. It's, it's curved and not pointy at all. All right. Here's my list. Link to let me Google that for you. Yeah, right. You know, the real challenge is going to be from all of this is figuring out what audio to put here. Okay, the marquee. I think I want the marquee at 10 now. So it matches up with the box. Which is the way that these... Oh no, I guess that's a little off to the side too. Shit. Alright. Nineties AOL connecting sounds. Nice. You keep pressing F3 and nothing's happening. Don't worry. Just keep hitting a gadget one day. Blue screen of death, you're here for it. Just all the dial up. All the dial up. Just I have a fun party trick, and by fun I mean it's the nerdiest thing that you might have ever seen but i can dial like a dial-up phone number like if you have a dial-up number that you connect to the internet with i can call it and i can whistle into the phone and trick it into thinking that i'm another computer and it starts making the staticky sounds at me if i had a nickel every time i got that advice i'd have two nickels which isn't a lot but it's weird that it happened twice right Just give them the give them the the website. Give them the website. Hmm. Okay, like this, like this a lot. Now, let's see. I think I'm gonna change the text down here to... This, I think I'm gonna change the title to...
Ice Bear is ready to Tokyo Drift. Ever! Ever, thank you for the 100 bits. I'm still not doing your homework. <clears throat> the ones that can search for on their own. Yeah, exactly, Liz. Exactly. No. Absolutely the fuck not. You're right. That's that's busy work. Like that's busy work. Like solve a, solve an actual problem. Give them the resources. Don't just hand them the the answer on a silver platter. Give them the resources to do their own research and find their own answers. And then there you go. They'll be fine. Ice Bear is ready to Tokyo Drift. Everyone, thank you for the additional 100 bits. I'm still not doing your homework. I love that I'm doing all of this for, like, the setup portion, and this is only, Drift. like, the first part of it. Ever! Thank you for the additional 100 bits. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's worth at least bringing up and saying, listen... I you want to give them resources, but you don't want to do the work for them. Be like, hey, I think this is a good way to give them the information without handing them the information. It gives them, it. you know, they have to think, which is the point. That's the point of school, is thinking. Critical thinking and analysis. Teach them how to fish for scholarships. Exactly. And if they are fish, fish, teach them about fish scholarships. There you go. Okay. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I'm into this. Chill lo fi Pokemon Center theme. Gen one, baby. Gen one. What is the code for? Is that? I think that's it, yeah? That's our bullet point, yeah? Oh, we got... Oh, we can do... Let's do 2022. Um, uh, what is it? Is it please wait while setup installs? Or... Yeah, I like that. And then we're going to bump this way the hell up. So we're going to put this up to like line four I got okay two line breaks a couple of non-breaking spaces Another non-breaking space, and then the marquee text. This is going to come off and disabled. Only above, but you don't... No, and that's the thing. 
that's that's the thing, Liz. Like, again, I think it's about. Iceberg ready to Tokyo drift. drift. God, damn it! Ever now, while I do your homework, fine, but only your algebra. Anything else, it's going to cost you way more. Ever, thank you for the thousand bits. Uh, I think I might leave it as tip of the day down at the bottom. I like tip of the day. I like putting it down a little bit further. Uh, let's take it up to about there since we've yeah, I like that. I like that. Oh, thanks, Ever. I appreciate you. I'm going to bribe the bear. Yeah, well, you know, I mean... These are, these are the things that happen, I guess. Tip of the did I put an extra space in there? Or is it just it's just the scaling messing with my brain? I like this. I'm not going to call this marquee anymore. I'm going to call this. I'm going to call this info text. I'm going to take this up to four again, but we're going to put more text in here. So please wait. I'll set up loads. Uh, stream. Thanks, Liz. I'm pretty happy with it. What? This is, this is an actual VM, which is fine and all, but I don't need, I don't want that. Installers were so pretty in their own way. They really were like, that's the thing, right? Gadget is that back in these days you had, what was it? Like 80 characters wide and 25 typically lines of screen real estate to work with, right? So you only had so many characters that you could do things with and you had to do a lot in a small space with using just text characters, just using, using this basically, using this list of stuff. And you had so much that you had to be able to do using just this list of characters to build out a UI, to show like, to indicate stuff. And just the fact that you can do this kind of stuff like the fact that they they built stuff like this like a dialog box over top like just blows my mind that they were able to do this with with the tools that they had and in that day like just absolutely mind blowing the kind of things that people were able to accomplish I just want the list of the files. That's all I want. It is cool, though, that you can, like, 
run this in the browser, which is just wild. DOSBox running in a browser. Mount View. No working as amazing as it at all. And Portland DOS UI stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, there's so. Oh, what the hell is it called? Um, I think it's called console.cs. I don't remember what the hell it's called. Or terminal.cs or something like that. GUI CS. This is it. Okay. Um. Is a terminal.gui, yeah. So GUI CS, they call it terminal.gui now. But, um, like Miguel de Acaza, the guy who created GNOME, like Linux GNOME, he created this thing called GUI.cs, they call it terminal.gui now. But the, uh, the point is, it's a framework for building UI in C Sharp in the console. And Mono, yes, the guy that also created Mono. Um, but like, it's a, it's, it's like a whole ass fucking like terminal UI framework for C sharp apps for C sharp console apps. Absolutely phenomenal. Like just amazing. Like I love it. I love everything about it. Like, it's just so cool. But it's got support for like all like different kinds of controls, menus. I mean, it's really well built. It runs in .NET Core. It's just so, so good. Going through PowerShell, XAML and WinForms work in PowerShell, but they can be tedious. Yes, that's true. I, I mean, it might work pretty well. There's like graphs and shit that it can do. It renders fucking graphs. Like, come on. Come on, man. Like, there's a binary editor with the fucking, like, Address spaces and everything, like. What's we got here? List views and combo boxes. Oh yeah, the mouse positioning. Just, like there's so much shit that's in this library. It's wild. And I, like, I, I love it. Why aren't you doing things? What are you doing? I guess it's... Yeah, it's fine. Anyway, I like this. Now I just gotta figure out... Hmm. 
trying to think of what I want to put in like. What I want to put like here. Let's see. info text I need to also have this I need to have this set to the right as well so it wraps yep that's what I needed okay Now we I'm going to keep consistent here. I like this. I think that'll be good. Yeah, let's... Let's do a few, Let's do a couple more line breaks up here just to... give it some separation. Let's see how this goes. <gasps> Rune, hi there. Welcome over on the live space side. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Might change what the actual text says for the tip of the day stuff. Like to make it a little bit different. And yeah, I like that. What, Wisty? Sugar, nice gadget. For decades. Damn it, Tay. Uh, I'm sorry, Wisty, but I have to say... Reverse.
Reverse. No, you. No, you. All right, let's see. How are we doing? I th I really like this. Um, I think I'm gonna actually put Zunder score just because I. I'm going to take the hashtag out of there because I don't think it fits with the aesthetic. <coughs> Ooh. Excuse me. That snuck up on me. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Wistie, I already said it, so. I saw your mad scientist hair, Wistie, honestly. I'm for it. I dig it. It's a, it's a vibe, and I love it. Okay, I I want opinions. Like, do we like the tip of the day on a, like on a single line like this, or do we like the spacing with like a bullet point like this? Because I can't decide. So, do we like the the single line, or do we like? bullet point <clears throat> you like the bullet point the bullet point mm. Okay, I think that's uh I think that's our winner. <clears throat> Ooh, I need to do a hanging indent there. Um <clears throat> So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this as an inline block. Um, <clears throat> let's change this to Bump this to just a three for now. <clears throat> Ooh, no, that's not what I want. Um, hmm. That didn't do what I wanted it to do. Wistie, thanks for the lurk. Love you bunches. Hi, Sultry. How are you? <clears throat> um, okay, then in that case, I'm just going to take this out. Uh, and then the... Marquee text is going to have, I'm going to position it. So let's go. <clears throat> um, let's 
the one, two, three, four. Because I got two spaces, the bullet, another space. And then the top, I've got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nope, I was off by one, as is tradition. <clears throat> You all seem very like I don't need you anymore. My line height was messed up. It was just, it was adding too much margin between lines. Sick. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm okay. <clears throat> I'm uh, I've been working on the new stuff, which I'm very very excited about and it seems to be working well now. Like, love this. This is great. And so, really, really liking this. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I think that's... Let's go to, let's go to OBS and refresh and see how it looks in here. <clears throat> I think I'm going to bump this up to 90 and to put my spinners at, no, they're still at 50 milliseconds, so. Oh, I'm a dingus. I'm <clears throat> I should be lowering that. I'm a dingus. Actually, I'm going to make this less than or equal to. Okay, that's 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 more like it. That's a little, now we can bump this back up to a hundred. <clears throat> Why were you undefined? It was briefly undefined. <clears throat> I guess I don't need the placeholder there now. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. <clears throat> Have I tried not being a... No, absolutely not. And honestly, I'm offended that you would think so. So, the heck with you, Vivian, and your face. Get wrecked, nerd.
I like that. <clears throat> so the only thing now is I want to do something on the right margin, like the file copy thing that we have. Like, <clears throat> I don't know. I might, I don't know what I want to do with it yet though. Cause like down here, down like below me right here, I have the clock, which is great. I love the clock. Um, that's for like the main scene while I'm running. That's not for the load. So let's do this. Let's go. Twenty times twenty. I don't think I need the padding there. Now let's come to the footer. We'll go span. Ah. Uh. Then I need like the full bar, which is twenty five oh two. We'll go um and pound next twenty five oh two. Let's see how that looks. That's really far. Oh, you know what I bet it is? That's why I just have to do that. At loaf.exe. Yeah, it's fine. I do think I'm gonna do this like from the left though. Let's go 74. That gives me 20 characters. Is that enough? Oh, just off. So I'm gonna do 72 which gives me enough for an 8.3 with at least one buffer character at the end. <clears throat> I think that's good. Yeah. I like that a lot. <clears throat> I might come up with like uh something like I might come up with a list of things to put down here. <clears throat> I need to bean.exe at some point in the progress. Yeah, that's I I wanna I I gotta come up with like a list of what's gonna be there. But I like this. Okay, so let's go and fix the count. So, all right, we s the counter's going to run for the five minutes now. I guess I could start this at zero percent. Let's go. Ice bear is ready to Tokyo drift. Tay. 
Buddy, I really appreciate you. Thank you for all your support. I really, really appreciate it. Do a manual countdown of the 55 minutes. Ice Bear is ready to Tokyo Drift. Damn it, Ever. Ever, thank you for another 100 bits. I'm still only doing your algebra. And you'll count down the five minutes. No, that's okay. <clears throat> like I know it's gonna work. I know the like the five minute countdown is gonna work now. Because I, I have it in place and I've got the counter doing its thing, which is what I want, so that's good. Um because I've got it set here to go for every one thousand milliseconds, it's gonna update the counter and it's gonna count all the way up to three hundred seconds. You're trying to coerce a hype trade. Listen, you, you, you kids do what you're gonna do. No, not, not there, there. Um, this is good though. Like I'm, <clears throat> like this has turned out really good. Like I'm really happy with the way this looks. Uh, I need, to, you know what else I should do since I updated that one thing? Okay, that hasn't affected this, which is good. I didn't think it would, but... Yeah, my line heights are all good. Everything's good. Everybody's happy. <clears throat> Go on, Hidden. I'm, I'm listening. Ever, how dare you? How how absolutely dare you? Done for the last thirty seconds of the loading screen. I I I I do want to incorporate that at some point. So this may be like a three phase thing, right? And so we might have because we gotta have to have like a bio screen. So like the um I need like a post with a logo. Yeah, like this. Okay. So I need like Come on, can you give me a slightly higher res one? Perfect, that's it. That's the one. Okay, so I need something like this at first. <clears throat> All right. And then when it's time to start the countdown, we do like a little animation, we go through our thing, and then we load this. And then once this is done, then we go to the third part. Replace the Energy Star logo with the Twitch logo. No, I'm going to put my logo in there. Are you kidding me? Viv, you're, you can always make a suggestion, buddy. Posted in feedback. Well, I mean, I have. <clears throat> I mean, I have this. That's that's like I use that everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I need to update this at some point. I have literally been using this for almost 25 years. I made this almost 25 years ago and I have hung on to it since. And I need to update it. I don't know, it's not that like, 
I don't want to like come do something completely new. I just want to do something like just modernize it a little bit, like make it a little newer and a little more better. -er -er -er. If that makes sense. Like it's just it, it's due for a yeah, something something a little more fresh. Right, exactly. Hi balls. Hi buddy. Impression this project was entirely different. Is it a completely different direction what your coach is trying to get you to do now? Good. Good, Liz. Do that. <clears throat> Things are good. I'm I'm really enjoying like doing this whole thing. Like Oh, Viv, that's a good idea. Oh. Shit. Shit, Viv, that's a good idea. Son of a bitch. That's two in one day. I like that. I just... I, now I gotta figure out the logistics of how I'm gonna do that. I do like having petloaf.exe down here, though. Yeah, we just put something good in the feedback channel. It's really, really good. That's that's a good one. Like that that might be a case for the copying. Like instead of copying, we could do like chatting and see like what's down there, and just put like. Put screen names. Oh, that's... <laughs> oh, Hidden, you don't know? <laughs> that's Viv. He's a doo-doo crumbs McAss cakes looking bitch. <laughs> oh... <laughs> Fantastic. All right. Yeah, I like this. I need to trim the edit the chatter name to be 8.3. Oh, abs absolutely, Gadget. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Ooh, the, the, like the transparency on the fucking menu is wild here. Like, it's always there, but like on the blue, it's very stark. I would have to go back and find the TikTok where that's from. I, 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 yeah. I'd have to go back and look for it. All right, so this right now is a good like done for the moment now 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 what the hell? Um... I love that it still shows the rest of it, though, and that's pretty funny. <clears throat> I'm a little irritated that that's not 
hiding all the child elements, but... Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, that's the visibility. I always forget to set that one as a thing. And uh, no passive visibility hidden. No, that's still doing it. What the fuck? That's kind of annoying to me. Like, even with stuff being fixed, they're all child elements of this, like, one top-level, like, parent element. It should go the fuck away. It's black because I, I'm trying to hide, like, everything inside this div, but it's not hiding it. Like, I've set, on the parent element, I've set visibility hidden, opacity of zero, display of none. You got Wasn't I just here? I was. To hide elements and their descendants on a web page. Bad elements, right? Well, it ain't fucking it applying to these child elements. That's honestly really irritating to me. I love that, like, because it's using the default page background. That's kind of annoying. Like, come on, man. <clears throat> Guess I could just do... Let's do a CSS rule for all children of an element. Found Combinator.
Oh. I wonder if it's because... That might be why. Sam, what are you doing? Zam, what are you doing? Zam. Pendant Combinator. Oh, I guess that means I could just do, yeah, that's right. Ice bear is ready to Tokyo yeah. Drift. <laughs> Ever stop it. <laughs> stop that. Oh, do I even need the important in here now? Because, like, because it's the second class, it should take precedence. Hmm. All right, what's well, you really pissing me off now thing? Uh, <clears throat> oh, son of a... I'm an idiot. That's why. I'm an idiot. Uh, I was putting a class name into an ID field. There we go. There we go. Zammy, what are you doing, buddy? Okay. I f hey, I figured it out because I'm a dingus. Thanks, Viv. Hello? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's right. That's what it is. That's exactly what it is. Okay, now...
All right, you. Position fixed. Top zero. Bottom zero. Left zero. Right zero. Yes, yes. Okay. Sorry, I just got a notification. I'm checking on something real quick. <clears throat> okay, cool. Um, Dudu comes, McCass cakes looking bitch. The blink tag was back. <clears throat> I could put I could put the uh I could put blinky blink inside of a blink tag. That's terrible and I'm not gonna do it, but I could. Well that's why I have a CSS class for that. I have a CSS class specifically <clears throat> for cursor blink. And then I have a one second blink that does like an alternating every second, which is how the uh, the colon in the time down here works. <clears throat> You're just off and on forever. Forever and ever and ever. <clears throat> Let's see. Left, zero, right. Oh, ah. Bottom zero. That's fine. And then I want the BIOS post. Post. BIOS logo. Position. Absolute. Eh, I can make these fixed because like the BIOS post is going to go away, like it's going to show up and then disappear and then start the other stuff. So, um, okay, so this is, I want this to be, I want this to be on the extreme top right corner. Um, and I want this to be height of, Let's get dimensions correct here. This is going to be about, let's go, half, quarter, let's say about, I want to say about 20%. So we're going to go, let's, or time, no. Times point two is two sixteen, so we'll go we'll say two hundred and ten pixels. <clears throat> and that'll be fine. Then we can come here and we can go image source equals hash images the icon. We can move this up to here for now.
I can make that 25%. We can make that. We can make that like. <laughs> Text lines down and base it on there. Line side, that's true. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. That's five lines. <clears throat> that's 200. I mean, that's, yeah. Because, like, each line here, each line in my thing is 40 pixels tall. That's one, two, three, four, five lines. That's a height of 200. You did a thing? How dare you? Oh, my God. Okay, that's... Hidden, that's pretty amazing. That's pretty fantastic. My only hesitation is that, like, I don't want to put, like, the Twitch logo on stuff, because Twitch stuff, but I do, I like the direction that's going. I like that. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't want to put, like, Twitch branding stuff, because, like, I also stream on, well, you know, on live space. <clears throat> but that's pretty cool. I Hidden, can I show everybody what you did? And what is this? This is great. Hidden made a thing, which pretty neat. Pretty cool. No, that's fair, Hidden. That's fair. <clears throat> that's really good, though. That's really good. I like that. Okay, so we're going to do... Can I do, what CSS filters are there? Brightness, contrast, drop shadow, grayscale, hue, rotate, invert. That's fucked up. Reach depending on which platform you're on, but that's yeah, I don't I don't wanna overcomplicate it with just the logo. I mean, normally, I like Gadget, I would agree if I wasn't on multiple platforms. But I don't want to put, like, all of my, like, I don't want to make my branding all specific to a platform when I'm on multiple platforms, if the, you know what I mean? Damn. Um... Think, how can I what can I do this like I don't know so I I don't know what I want to put here but we'll we can get at least get going with the Um, fixed, top zero, left zero. All right, we're gonna have one of these. We're gonna come down here. Open. Oh. 
Can I just... Are we allowed to just make arbitrary tags these days? Like, that's a thing that we're allowed to do in HTML these days, isn't it? You just make arbitrary fucking tags as long as they're not, like, reserved. I can make anything a tag. I don't think I can make anything a tag, but I can make a lot of things a tag. Let's see, I want the non-breaking space. Two of those, and a line break. Two of those. And then two line breaks. Hmm. I don't know what else to put there. Oh, that's three spaces. And we have... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um... <clears throat> Um, be an insert of the current year. Oh, damn. Mm. No, it's fine. It's fine because I guess I could do this because that's when I started Strimmons. Eventually, I, well, that's the thing. Like with a BIOS, it doesn't show current year. It shows the latest year that the BIOS was updated, right? So... But why? Why? What in the hell just happened here? Okay. Can I do that? Is that available? No. What? Uh, that doesn't take me anywhere. There's two logos on that screen. The one for the little word, the big one for the... I know. I know. That's why I put, like... That's why I put a little bit of space out here. I don't know what I'm going to put here yet. I want to put something here. I just don't know what yet. So I kind of left a little bit of space to just be like... Mm -hmm. I don't know. I gotta figure that out. That's that's on my that's on my list of stuff that I want to figure out what to put there. I just don't know what I like yet. 
Is this just node? Stop. Stop. I think this is all node. Yeah, that's, I don't, I can't use node. I'm in the browser. Performance object. <clears throat> Hmm. A cross stream logo, but also a Twitch one. Yeah, but I that's the but I still don't want to put Twitch branding on my stuff. Like I don't want Twitch branding on my stuff at all. Um, I just I don't want to go down that road because then something's gonna happen, and then eventually I'm gonna have to redo all of it, and I just ugh. Right one could be low for something. Yeah, maybe. The Twitch shoelaces and a Twitch hoodie. I have I have Twitch. I want to say I have like little, little things that go on the shoelaces. I for I forget what those things are called. That's yeah. That's that's pretty good hidden. I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I I don't I don't know if I want to like go that. I don't know yet. I don't know. No, no, I, I mean, I, I dig it. I think it's, I think like the concept is really cool. I just don't know what I want to do yet. What I do want is I want to get CPU information from JavaScript, but not with, no, okay, hardware concurrency. The number of logical processors, which is, wait, is there a CPU prop? No. There's a GPU property. What's OS CPU? Oh. Nope. Nope. Don't want that. <clears throat> Everybody just mess around nice. Uh, there's a GPU object for the current browsing context, which is the web GPU API. But I want the CPU name, that's all I want, which I guess that's a that's not a great thing to expose. Hmm. Da, 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 da. Like hardware concurrency just gives me the It's just a number of CPUs, like logical processors. That's too hard. I mean, yeah. Well, I mean, I want it to be, you know, what if I change it later? Or what if I'm, you know, broadcasting from some other machine? Available in secure context. 
Oh. Get devices. That's pretty cool, though. I could make up a fake something. Yeah, that's true. I could. Do this. Let's put in, like, what I actually have for now, just as placeholder. Can I... Will that actually copy? I don't know if it will. That's what do we do here? We list the, the processor. Ooh, can I get CPU ID off of this? Uh, no. I don't see my CPU ID here anywhere. Dang. We live on Krypton if it's made of Krypton. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, Hidden. Hidden. Did you know it's cold? I didn't know if you knew. I hope this helps. Um. He's very chill. Yeah, this is I. This is some pretty good stuff we got here. I'm digging it. Yeah, that's the spinner. That's the marquee stuff. Uh, I might actually. Yeah, let's move this down a little bit, and then I'll do, um, we'll go, that's, Megs. Oh, wait, no, that's, yeah, okay, that's total K. Uh, yeah. I don't want total bytes, I want total K. It's fine. So let's go function. Uh, do memory test. We'll go. Oh, thanks, Gadget. I'm just... I, you know, this is, this is fun stuff for me. Like, I enjoy doing this stuff, and, you know, I just, I just, I don't know. I think it's neat. And I figured somebody else will think it's neat. So, you know, we'll just see how it goes. Um... God... Okay, if Oh, I could probably do that down here too, I guess. The update counter. I don't have to clear the interval. You just, mm, yeah, I can do it that way. I don't know. For this, I'll just do it this way. 
Go set timeout. Uh, do memory test. We'll do this every like 50 millisecond. Oh, how do I want to do this? Oh, that's actually a really cool idea. Like, I could do it in sequence. So, like, I kick off the first thing, which shows, like, the BIOS text. It'll do the memory count, and then it'll start to render the next stuff underneath it. That's actually a cool idea. I like that. So, like, we start, and then we, like, we show this stuff, and then we, like, do the memory test. And then after this, then we show this stuff. We show this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. I like that. Um All right, we'll go Let's do this in 32k increment. God, let's that's going to take forever, I feel like though. Let's do 64. Um Quaker Oats Salmonella Recall? Nope. But we don't uh, buy Quaker Oats. We buy store brand, baby. And we get our like we get it from Target, and they always like notify us of recalls and stuff via email, which is really nice because we do all of our stuff in the app, which is also really nice. Check your snacks. Yep. <clears throat> okay, now this is the BIOS memory byte count. Set element text. Um. Yeah. It's all set up, right? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> dot. Class list dot. Remove. Hide. <clears> hmm. <throat> true. 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 Um. Okay. So. Oh my god, that's hilarious. And it's going to take forever to run the memory test. All right, we're going to we're going to bump this up to fucking
You put on pants? Oh, thank God. Kidding, I'm kidding. Can we underscore to separate? And I think we can. Let's not be old school PC delay on that. Yeah, let's. I mean, 16 meg at a time isn't bad, but I might do 32. No, I might do 64. Oh god. Oh, I'm still off by a factor. Fuck. Uh, let's do... No, let's do... 24 times... Oh, yeah, okay. Let's do 256 at a time. <clears throat> Alright. That's still slow. It's better. Everyone, please control yourselves. <gasps> this Trina. is a mature party. And no! Trina, what are you doing? Everybody, welcome in from the Trina raid. Hello, hello. For those of you who don't know me, I am Zunderscore. I'm a variety streamer. I do a lot of RPG, um, Strategy, platformer, uh, roguelike kind of stuff. Uh, I also do some code and a little bit of design. And today I'm doing coding style stuff, working on some new stuff for stream. Uh, so my overlay that you see that's all like old school PC, I just, uh, I just got this set up in the last couple of days. And now I'm working on the loading screen for my stream to make it look like an old PC booting up. So, you know. You have dance practice? Okay, Trina, listen, get out of here. Go have fun. I love you bunches. Thank you again for the raid. Mwah! It is wonderful to see you as always. Um, but welcome in, everyone. I hope everyone is having a great day wherever you are, whenever you are. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. All right, I think I might change the factor of this to megabytes. And where's the I think we're gonna do that. Oh, let's see. Oh, and the ad break just started. God damn it, ad break. All right, I think this will be better. I don't need this anymore. I think this will be better with That's fine. Damn you, ad break. How am I supposed to impress under these conditions? I know, right, Hidden? Oh, uh, we could do 1024, I think. Well, eh, not 69, 96. Ad break. Soon. Bye, Liz, love you bunches. That's the winner. That's our winner right there. Yep, okay. Um, now what's our next part? Yeah. 
Yeah, we can stick in like a fake Western digital in there. I don't care. Um, I don't know what to call this. <clears throat> um, Western Digital, something silly and said. Eastern Analog, that'd be funny. Let's see. ID equals, um, BIOS hardware. I guess we can call it storage details. All right, now let's go. This guy, I want to be a, this to be our inline. I guess I could just make that a span. I don't need to make that a div. Um, yeah, that's fine. I can just make this a span. We can come in here, we can say, uh, Yeah, that's, I like that. What do I actually have in this thing? Yeah. I got a one terabyte and a two terabyte and I can do. loud for me. <clears throat> All right. Um document dot get ID dot class list dot move hide.
smoking vest. That's right. That's right. Um, <clears throat> and then. Function. Go drives. Yep. Make that three. Okay. Is there another? That's all like the ID. No, okay. I guess we could just do like done here. We'll call it that and yeah that's fine I'm fine with that then when we refresh this we do our memory test oh that's oof Okay, that's a little... Okay. <clears throat> All right, let's do this. Let's go... here oh hello yeah oh you need some treats got some treats Giving Loaf some Tritos. That's your sweet baby loaf and also a bean. How you boob. There we go. Jeff says he says hello. Oh, loaf also says hi, but she's having Tritos, which is very important for the loaf. Uh. 
Uh, probably about 20 minutes or so. <clears throat> All right, now we'll come down here. Oh. All right, what's the order here? We show, do the memory test. We show memory speed. We do storage details. Then we show the ID detecting message. Then we show a storage scan done. No. Yes. About a half a second between each one of these. What in the hell is this remix? This is Super Mario Blinding Lights, Viv, yes. It is absolutely Super Mario Blinding Lights. It's well done. Well done, buddy. All right, now I need the the footer. <clears throat> All right, now I need uh, let's see and less than than uh, oh wait, class equals BIOS hotkey. There's both pieces of the mashup. Yeah, yeah, that's, it's wild. Color. That's a bright white. Oh, I didn't set the, uh,
Bios post. Oh, shit. Okay, we're going to put... The disguises or just the model info? Um, well, see, that's the thing. Like, it has sort of, sort of. So, like, that's a that's a three point two gig drive right there. I think because like the model numbers typically have like the storage space or the storage size as part of the model number. At least with Western Digital, it does. And then like a firmware version. Um, E for the firmware versions, two or three decimals. That's pretty cool. I have a couple of ideas I'm gonna I wanna play around with. Man, this is this is a fucking bop right here. Fucking yeah, this is it. This is great. All right, let's go. Um, I need. Oh, right. Um, Nope. There we go. Get full year. We're going to do like we do here. Yeah, we're going to do this. I'm gonna do this whole thing right here. All right, what else is in that footer? Um, okay, we're gonna go. This is a Kingdom Hearts song. It is. The version info, like the date is the bio state, not the system date. Yeah, true. Okay, I guess I could put then the, what's today? The 17th? All right, we can do that. We 
We can use we can use today's date since we're making it today. Well, you were telling me to make the copyright date live. That's different. I think that's fine. I think that's all. Hmm. I know. I know, Gadget. I'm just trying to figure, figure out what I want to put there. Some sort of plain reference. Yeah, that's that would be pretty cool. I don't know. Um hmm. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I still want to have something like Alphanumeric there. I can put AMD BIOS, that's fine. Because I do have my actual processor in here. Okay. You convinced me. Oh, that's just enough little bit of entropy there that I like that. <laughs> it's just that easy. All right, let's see, what else do I have for... Let's add a couple more hotkeys in here. Uh, I need a non-breaking space. I need F5 refresh. Is that the boot menu? Um, well, 
What is that? Q flash? <laughs> it suddenly it wants to translate it for me. Well done. I have confused it enough to where it wants to translate. Oh, I need to do not spaces for consistency. Yep. Translate from Welsh. Well done. The boy howdy super speed. You like that, Viv? Huh. Yeah, I sure am. Perfect. I think I'm going to move this up here. Because this is, none of this is going to, like, this is all going to load before we run it down here. This is the bio stuff. Okay. Now I want to do um Oh, wait. I'm going to to do here. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> yeah, I'll gadget. I'm listen. I'm having entirely too much fun with this. Okay. Ooh, wait. Okay. Wait for it. Did I save that? I did. Please control yourselves. This is a mature party. How dare you? No! How dare all of you? 
Batsy, how dare you? How dare you? And Hidden, how dare you? And Batsy, you absolute, you absolute piece of shit theater kid. Hello, hello, Raiders. Welcome in. Uh, I'm Zunder. I'm a variety streamer. I'm doing code stuff today. I'm making new fun things. And I'm, uh... Yeah. That's it. That's all I got. I'm I'm just working on new stuff. Current screen between bias and setup like a loading stream setup. Uh there will be gadget and there will be. That is the to do right here. You just got full Chivos? Did you, Batsy, did you hundred percent Hades? Did you hundred percent hot Greek mythology game? No, you're fine, Gadget. You're fine. You're not... That's that's what this is there for. So what I think I'm going to end up doing... Let's, let's do one last thing here. We're going to call this ID... Okay. And then what I can do here is or I can do now uh, let's do uh, class list dot add hide. And then we'll get the BIOS post. And then we'll remove the hide from it. And and then, yeah. But what I'll do is, when I do this down here at the bottom, I'll do a timeout on it. And of uh, let's do three seconds just to start out i think i will eventually make this like a some kind of like check that i run i don't know <laughs> a greek tragedy oh that's fair that's fair batsy listen go take a break i'm actually about to get out of here in just a second i'm finishing up my the last of what i'm doing today Yeah, I'm I'm gonna put a little delay there. They're my problem now? God damn it. This was long boy stream. It was, it's true. True. Try that again. Bye. Quarter of a second. Like here, I would love to put in like a floppy drive sound. Love to add a floppy drive sound there, which I will probably do. And like the beep. Just to have like, nah, 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 beep, and then keep going. Wow, hidden, get out, hidden, get out. Get out, you're too young to be here, get out. Get out, you whippersnapper. How dare you? How absolutely fucking dare you? You well, I guess I guess there's that.
Floppy drives is what some of folks use to make music. Yes, that's ex yes, that's exactly it. Hi, <laughs> insanity. Welcome in. <laughs> you were like six when Windows ninety eight came out. Oh my god, hidden. Hang on. Wow. Oh, hidden. Oh, hidden. Just, just a wee bobby. The old mysterious music machine of the past. <laughs> I fucking love it. Um. All right. I think that's where we're going to have to call it for today. Uh, this is really good. Like, we're getting there. We just have really, like, one... Like, a couple of a little things to add here. Um, and then I think we're pretty much done with this. Hi, Loaf. Loaf says it's time to go, too. Um... All right, yeah. You know, I must, it's true, it's true. She's, she is the kitten's cat. She says when it's time to come snuggle, she does, she knows the snuggles. Um, let's see, what else? I think this is pretty much it for now. All right. Yeah, I'm going to probably play around with this some a little bit off stream just to see. You know, your cat is chewing on plastic. Wait, Winry? Is it Winry? Of course it is. Of course it's her. Of course. Why why wouldn't it be her? She's she's a bit of a dingus. Henry is a grumpy old man, it's true, but he's so majestic. So majestic. Um, all right, well, this is great. I'm super happy with the way this is looking. Um, I think we're just going to, uh, I think we're going to be done here for, uh, for the day. I am going to... I do want to have like the interstitial like between this and this. I want to have like the little thing in the middle there. Um Let's see. If we have anything else that's Oh yeah, this is this is the thing that yeah, this is what we need. Be a blue screen of death. I don't know yet. I I haven't decided what I'm going to make the endings yet. Um I'm I'm debating between that and like the old school it's now safe to turn off your computer thing. Uh If I can type it. Like there's this guy, but there's also like the the Windows NT one, which is really good. I also like this one. But it's graphical and I don't know how I, f I don't know yet. Regardless, I think we did, we did a lot of cool stuff today. All right. All right, we, uh, we did good. That was good. That was a good times. Um, ooh, boy, that is... That is a lot of stuff on that news bar that is just not happy about. Look at it all go away. That's great. 
I want to just I want to just watch and see if it actually clears itself up. I I'm I like at this point I'm just like I'm like how fucked is it? Oh, there we go. There we go. Are we good? Are we good? I think we're good. Anyway, okay. Um hey, thank you all for hanging out. Thank you for uh all the bits and uh the we got raids from both Trina and Batsy today. And oh, we got one from the one from Ever earlier. Uh yeah, we had a lot of stuff happen today. It was big big time. Uh I I got to go I got to apparently go do uh, I gotta do Ever's algebra homework for her now because she bribed me. Um, and then I'm gonna go and see about doing some, uh, figure out din dins and stuff. Um, so hey, thank you all so much again for hanging out. Um, live space folks, thank you, thank you as always. Uh, I will see y'all tomorrow night. Uh, as for the Twitch folks, we are gonna get ready to raid out. Um, so let's go and figure out who's doing stuff and things. <clears throat> do, do, do. She paid me fair and square. That's, that's, it's true. It's true. She did. She did. Um, we're going to go see, we're going to go see mom. We're going to go see nine. Uh, Nine's channel is PG-13. Okay, respect it. It is PG-13 over there. I know we say a lot of bad words here. Do not use bad words over there. Be respectful. Follow the rules. Um, we love Nine very, very much. She's wonderful. She's our, she's, well, she's my Twitch mom. And, uh, yeah, we'll, PG-13, but fart friendly. Yes, so many farts. It's basically just all farts, yarn, and rubber chickens over there. So, you know, bad words like crash and blue screen. <laughs> um, anyway, thank you all all for hanging out. Yeah, I love you bunches. I will see you tomorrow night um, for some gamey games. Uh, until then, as always, please, please remember, be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. And I will see you. Uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.